story uh, out of Salinas, California. November 22, the CDC issued a warning of potential E. coli infected romaine lettuce. Tell yes. us about it. Have you noticed that year mm -hmm. after year we have the same exact thing coming from the same place? The same scare every time. And it's every year. And you don't have lettuce about this end of summer, fall-ish time, and all, and and nobody's figured it out yet. But we've got the same E. coli from the same area around Salinas, the North Central Valley of California, Central um, Coastal Valley of California, and um, and. So it, it caught my attention because I went to buy lettuce and there was none in the stores because mm -hmm. they've been pulled. And um, you would buy lettuce. Yes, it seems I do. to correlate with the ACA enrollment period. I don't see how it really break this down. <laughs> okay. Every time. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Explain what's it. going on. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Explanation. Well. I don't have the explanation. Oh, the question. Hold on, you but teased it. it. No, no, the, the, it. the point is that in this particular case, we started having reports, according, according to the FDA, they, were, they started having reports back in July. They didn't report it publicly until November 1st. They had to really make sure. And then they reported 23 cases, of, of, of which 11 were, were hospitalizations in 12 states. Now, in the last month, the CDC reports that there have been 40 cases in 16 states with 18 hospitalizations. So the, the, but my point is that it's been held, information is being withheld. This is about the third or fourth year in a row that this has happened, mm -hmm. without exception. And, and so, and still the, the, Everybody is in the dark as to how, who, what could be happening, how could be happening, what's going on, and it should not be well, that that I mean, giant a, a mystery. I mean, it's E. coli. I'm not. Where it came from. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not a scientist, but I have noticed there is an increase in fecal matter in the state of California everywhere. <laughs> And oh, I don't know. God. Is it, is it actually, a one-off? Actually, actually, I think <laughs> you bring up a good point. I had forgotten about this, but I believe that uh, California went to deal with some of their their fecal um, problems. They they have actually um, uh, uh, legalized, if you will, um, the uh, composting of of human feces. For for consumption, it's a bit of an entendre here. It's both a crappy yeah. place, literally. Well, yeah. exactly. I figured yeah. that may be, okay. that may be part of what's yeah. going on. It just I have not thought okay. about it. No, we may some... have just solved the. I think the you the gang. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> give, give us a little background here, Kenny. Yeah. You grew up in roughly that area, though. The the area. Yeah. The the Garden of America yeah. is that valley there in Central California. Uh, they grow, uh, I mean, it's the garden cell of Express coming out of there. Right. Year-round? Right. Um, well, they, they have two, three crops a year. Yeah. Okay, but they're able to have a climate in which they can be gardening, growing. Uh, gardening yeah, if, you put up a, if you put up a, a greenhouse, kind of a can okay. over it, you can do all your... Uh, okay, easily. and, you know, E. coli, I always assume that with, of course, fecal matter. And of right. Course, you know, look, I my grandpa's farm, we would, you know, clean out the barn and throw it on the manure spreader and drive, you know, out and, you know, manure spreader flings it everywhere. And then in the spring, we grow corn, you know. Right, right. And uh, so why are they getting that on the lettuce? You washed it off. Maybe they're trying to conserve the water. <laughs> because well, the state's constantly no, on fire. My <laughs> thing is, they you all the water you to put out the fire. You should be using your organic... Uh, fertilizer like this before you plant and it should be enough the problem is you know the lettuce it's going to fall down in there if you're spreading it or it's not broken down and it's in the dirt and you're flinging it up and it gets caught in the lettuce well you know again i don't know the answer i would love for any of our viewers to to get back to us yeah, on Chris, what they might think think these kinds of things yeah. would be but the but the point is, it's been happening. It's regular. That one year they blamed it on pigs rooting the in, around in the lettuce field. Okay. Although, although 
how does that work when they when the pigs destroy that okay. part of the, the the lettuce field because they're wild pigs? Now, now so. comes the conspiracy theory because we didn't <laughs> no, get to the start. answer. It's like, are we manipulating the markets? Because that's a viable motivation. Well, I mean, could it be, could that be the case? Or could somebody be sabotaging a very important export out of California? They are very protective of that. Well, and, and, and I'm to the point that I don't, I don't, I'm getting to the point I don't trust uh, California produce. Uh, certainly not on the lettuce side because they've gone after that so much. Yes. Um, yeah, I really don't trust anything from California. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. But, uh, like, like, welcome. Well, <laughs> my, I'm in my, Oklahoma for my, a reason. My oldest son's <laughs> first solo road trip, he was, I think, 19, and he drives out to California. And he calls me and he says, Dad, this is the weirdest thing. I'm going across the state line on Interstate 40, I think it was. It might have been 10, I don't know. And, and they've got this customs deal here. Guys, <laughs> and they're checking me. For produce, you're leaving oh, the United yeah. States of America they are and entering California. You the people who want to go produce, and they the explanation is they don't want any bugs or any pests or anything right. coming in that's going to harm that are not uh, natural or you know right. come from there. Do you have a but, chef sound to claim, sir? Now, now, I understand the economic downturn that came shortly after that. They had to shut down those most of those stations. Yeah, they should get and it was, it was really, they were just... Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right, because they didn't have them up when I've been bad. Yeah, yeah a couple of chat them. comments from Chris. Oh, yeah, In Chris Case, he said, uh, they, uh, Democrats, parenthetical, got to fret the exposure during the Senate trial. Trump wants the Senate trial. Mm -hmm. And he said, if, if the trial in the Senate happens, they'll be able to call witnesses and expose the whole plot in great detail. Oh, yeah. The press could never have gotten this yes. for the Biden issue, and they'll be there at the trial. Mm -hmm. So Dan's got to be, now going back, he's got to be really scared about that. So that's his Yes. Point. Yeah. And yeah. So it, it, yeah. If, if you're uh, Kendra Horn, this has got you yeah. scared. You are done, Kendra. Yeah. So really the question is, who yeah. wins this Republican primary yeah. run runoff? You and, are the congressperson. And she will be forever remembered <laughs> as somebody who cast a vote to give Adam Schiff the authority to do what he did. Will not recover. This is also coming to be same routine. The people who have children working for Ukrainian gas companies is Joe Biden, Pelosi, Kerry, John Kerry, and Romney. Oh, oh, yeah, that was the one I knew with the other famous oh, Democrat. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Romney was the, was the fourth oh, one. Well, oh, anyway, oh, yeah. so much for fecal matter. So, right. so <laughs> anyway, be careful. Uh, although it's been long ongoing, you might want to uh, wash your romaine really, really, really well. Sure. Or get rid of it, but um, you can't buy lettuce in the, in the grocery stores right at the moment. Certainly not romaine. And I wasn't paying attention to it. It won't be Thanksgiving like... without it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, the article is up on constitutional grounds and on 3D politics. So you yeah. got all the links to. It doesn't bother me. I'm like out eating red meat like a real man. <laughs> so, and, and, and for the good news, there's no, no reports from Oklahomans yeah. um, having. Okay. Okay.